let's just jump right in and see what we got on the item shop here. Okay, we still got the Balenciaga stuff, so that's always awesome. Cobra Kai. Oh, look at this. We got Munitions Expert, Survival Specialist, some OG Classic Fortnite skins back. Azuki is back. I love that skin. Ooh, Glum Bunny, Isabel, great skins, Focus, hey, they brought back the Dune skins, that's awesome, okay. I, I feel like everyone forgot about Dune, I, I went to go watch this at the movies, you know, when this came out, it was a pretty good film, I liked it, and yeah, it hasn't been back to the Fortnite item shop since that first uh, initial release, so this is actually kind of nice. If any of you are picking up anything on the Fortnite item shop today, or the Epic Games store, or the, uh, you know, buying up the Battle Pass or something, be sure to use code ASMR Gaming. Let's check out the Dune bundle. So, uh, we got the, uh, how do they pronounce her name? I forgot. I watched the movie and I forgot. Oh my goodness. Uh, oh. What was her name again? <laughs> a powerful Fremen warrior and skilled survivalist. It's basically Zendaya's character in the Dune movie. Super cool. I actually like these outfits a lot. We got the satchel back bling, personal Frem kit back bling. If you watch the movie, you understand everything that happened with that. We got Paul Atreides. Beyond fear, his destiny awaits. He's got two different styles, but she does not. That's always kind of interesting. But the story kind of explains why he needs uh, why he needs this mask basically to like breathe in the desert, whereas she doesn't because she has this little like tube here. Do you see that? So um, yeah, just thought I would point that out. Paul Atreides is awesome though. Uh, played by you know Timothy Chalamet in the movie. Great, great job. I, I honestly really enjoyed his performance in that. I can't wait for the next Dune movie. I felt like it ended on a cliffhanger. Not going to get too much into spoilers, but I really want to know what happens. Um, we got the Frem Kit back playing Essential for Survival on the Harsh Desert World of Dune. And of course, this comes with a free uh, like loading screen when you buy the bundle, so... It's kind of cool, look at that, there's like the sandworm in the background and stuff. Awesome. So large, it can swallow uh, entire cargo ships. Yeah, stick worm. But the stick worm kind of looks like a uh, fish stick uh, skin's face. <laughs> I like that, they, they made like a Fortnite version. So I'm going to attempt to say her name, it's either like Shani, Chani, I, I think it was Shani. Or it could be like Shani, Shani, something like that. I'm sorry, I need to watch Dune again if I completely forgot how to say her name. Someone correct me in the comments, please. Please correct me in the comments if you know. Um, but yeah, good movie, good movie. Honestly, I was not expecting to see the bundle back on the item shop. Uh, we also got the gear bundle here. The Dune gear bundle. We got the maker hooks. He's got a nice sound. A Fremen hook used to ride sandworms. We got the twin blades, the weapon of choice for an Atreides warrior. These are nice. I like these. The Ornithopter. I actually like this in the movie. Ornithopter, multi-winged attack ship. Great moment in the movie happens on one of these. And the Sandwalk emote. I feel if you're just gonna get one thing, you have to get the sandwalk emote. Walk without rhythm to avoid attracting sandworms. And yeah, that's directly from the books and the movies. Traversal emote, really, really good. Uh, let's see, it's only 200 V-Bucks, so you can definitely just pick that one up if you got some V-Bucks. Despair, honestly, very good set. Really happy to see that back. Over here we have the Focus skin, Visualize the Future. Nice outfit, kind of popular among uh, pretty pro like Fortnite players and stuff. Whenever I'm watching like uh, arena gameplay on like Twitch or stuff like that, usually they'll be using this skin. So 
definitely kind of popular. Comes with a chuck pack, back bling, wheeled responsibly. We got the fixation harvesting tool. This does not come back that often. Sharp, focused, and relentless. We got the glum bunny skin. Very nice and colorful skin. I know Lucky Girl likes this one. Uh, it's about to hop off. 800 B-Bucks. Definitely recommend. I should probably get this one. <laughs> it kind of reminds me of like, uh, I don't know, those like cool like uh, Japanese like outfits you sometimes see um, people doing like cosplays or whatever and, like Shibuya. I'm sure some of you know what I'm talking about, but like that kawaii fashion looks like that. Like pretty cool. I like the plushies there. <laughs> like four different plushies just hooked on like a belt along with the uh, grenades or whatever. <laughs> pretty cool. Over here we got the Isabel, um, what's it called? Isabelle's skin. Now, Isabelle's really cool because she's got like four different styles to choose from and an emote that allows you to transform in game. So, voted most likely to succeed or burn the place down. She has the Book of Spells Volume 3 Back Bling First Edition Natch and the Extracurricular Armor emote, which allows her to transform in game. For when knowledge isn't enough power, so yeah. If you use a skin, you can switch styles on the fly in game when you just use this emote. And it comes with a really nice animated like spell book back bling that randomly opens up and stuff. Really cool. The Astrolomaster Staff Prereq Spellcasting 201. I kind of like the constellations on this. You can see the Big Dipper there and stuff. Really nice. Um, and down here we got the henchman bundle back. Very unexpected. Um, we got the shadow enforcer. Get the job done. Nothing else matters. And the ghost enforcer. Ghost for hire. Cool to see them back. Uh, you can buy both of them separately or in the bundle. And then we got Azuki over here. Wandering warrior destined to end the Wiscaria Wars. A super cool skin. I had to get this when it came out. Looks awesome. Comes with a katana back bling. Can't have the paws without the claws. And the neon claws harvesting tool. Azuki's whisker thin ancestral blade. You can combine it, by the way. So if you don't want to use a dual harvesting tool, you can turn them into like one large one. Uh, then we still have Jones Unchained. Great skin. I use this for my previous video, Win. Go watch that if you haven't seen it yet. Munitions Expert is back. Classic OG skin. Same thing for Survival Specialist. A classic OG skin. If you're in the mood for some old OG Fortnite nostalgia, definitely worth getting one of these. And we have the Say So emote back for the Doja Cat fans out there. Roll with the changes. A. Hey. We got Sugar Rush. Ooh. This is nice. Sugar Sugar Rush does not come back that often. This is kind of a kind of a rare emo. Uh, yeah, definitely bet buy this one if you like it. Chances are we're not going to see this again for a while. Shake it till you crash. This goes perfect with a lot of uh, summer skins, by the way. Definitely gives me summer vibes with the dance. Love it. Bonker Buggy is also back. Celebrate together. Very happy emo. Nice dance. And the sproing emote. The spring is sproinged. Very simple but fun emote. So yeah, that's pretty much everything on the Fortnite item shop, I would say. You know, we still have all this other stuff here. Balenciaga and Cobra Kai. Let's see. But yeah, that's about it. We have these bundle packs. So thank you all for listening, for watching. Please be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you all next time. So long.